Hey YouTube, how's it going? This is uh, the help you need with another video tutorial. And in this video, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys um, some simple box modeling uh, technique. Um, and this, what we're going to do is we're going to create a foot. Alright, now, uh, most people know the shape of a foot. Um, we're going to do it as if you were doing it for a game. Um, so, I mean, it's going to be pretty low poly. And this is not going to be too much at having uh, to do with it. Uh, the first thing we want to do is create the foot in the top viewport, which is right up here. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to select about that much of it. And you want to make it the foot longer than you do um, the wide. And then we're going to lift up about uh, this height. And we're going to go ahead and change up the length and height segments. Um, so, let's see, we want to have three leg segments, and we'll put one or two height segments and three leg segments. Uh, width segments can stay the same. Okay, then we're going to go ahead and convert it to an editable poly, and the first thing we're going to do is apply a mesh smooth modifier here. So, there we go. And we're going to go ahead and click this button right here. This will keep the mesh smooth applied. Alright, so as you can see, right now you just have this kind of flat looking uh, foot. So what we're going to do is we're going to uh, go ahead and give him an ankle. So we're going to pull that straight up. And we can... And we'll just... Like that. Alright. So, as you can see, we have a... Uh, kind of a uh, boot type of shape here uh, but we're still not quite finished uh, we're going to go ahead and click G and that will take off the grid in our viewport and we're going to select now the underneath the foot right here and we're going to go ahead and add a heel okay so now he has a heel uh, we're going to click the one button on our keyboard which is the um, hotkey for the vertex selection mode and we're going to go ahead and select uh, a few vertices and we're going to come into our left viewport and we're going to select these right here and we're just going to move them up uh, we could also select these all and move them this way a little bit and we're going to now go into the edge mode which is two on your keyboard <laughs> we're going to make sure to select all three of these and we're going to select the connect tool and we're going to click one again and we're going to bring this um, down now we're going to make this straight with the uh, thing. this will give it just that way it has an arch in the foot okay, we'll go ahead and do that and we can actually pull these both down a tad bit probably about there and um Let's see, we'll go ahead and go into our perspective viewport, check out, see how this works. Alright, uh, now the last thing we want to do is the foot looks a little wide. Uh, out here is fine, but we want to go ahead and shrink it up. Um, so we're going to go into the top viewport, select the three over here, go over there, and we're going to select these as well. And there we go. Now as you can see, we have a good looking kind of a uh, boot model, although it looks a little funny on the uh, sides right here, so we'll go ahead and pull those in too. Uh, now you don't want those to be pulled in um, as much as the others are, so I guess actually perspective view would probably be the easiest view to do this in. Uh, so we're going to pull these. We're going to select um, both, of the, uh, both sides here. So. Uh, let's go ahead and click the control key and you can select those. And now we're going to click R on our keyboard, which is the scale. We'll move it on the X axis. And we'll just keep moving it until it looks about right, as it does right now. Alright, uh, well, that's this tutorial. Um, a lot more tutorials are going to come pretty soon. I'm going to try to do a tutorial a day, uh, which I've been doing. And. Uh, one last thing before we go, you can also select all these edges here, um, 
And sometimes you can bring it down to make it look good, but that's not going to do anything in this case. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and chamfer these. And this will make it look a little bit more, uh, or a little bit better. Alright, there you go. Um, now, obviously, the more iterations you put onto your uh, foot, the smoother it's going to look. Uh, but you'll also have to edit it a little bit differently. Uh, you'll also notice that the heel and the uh, rest of the ankle looks a little weird. Um, don't worry about that. You guys can fix that up if you want to. Uh, I'm not going to just because I don't need to uh, at the moment in time. Um, but maybe I'll do a, uh, when I get more advanced tutorials here, uh, we'll do a character tutorial where we'll create the whole character. Alright, uh, I hope to see you guys in the next videos. Uh, a lot more coming soon. And uh, have a good day.